What's up, guys? It's Alex. It's Quinn. It's Iconic Comic. We're back, ready to react to Mayweather versus McGregor, Rise of Connor McGregor. The Notorious. We are one day. One day away. From the biggest fight in combat sports history. Or when history. this gets published on YouTube. No, I'm publishing it immediately. Okay, so, well, it's still tonight. So, technically, so, it's today. Tonight. <sighs> tonight. I'm so excited. Is the fight. The super fight we've been waiting for. Look, I don't think it's... I've made it very... I don't think I've hit, hidden the fact that... I'm really pulling for McGregor in this fight. <laughs> well, let's stop wasting time. Let's watch this video. Let's get a little hyped. Ooh. Three. Sorry. Know your place. <laughs> Three. Three. You're on thin ice, bitch. Three, two, one. One more volume. The story of this fight is not just Conor McGregor. It's Ireland. It's never been an easy fight like this. Conor McGregor! Into the UFC! Enter him! Featherweight champion! Remember in 2009 when the UFC first visited Perfect Dublin? narration. Looking back, that's where it all began. That snapshot in time. Wow. Again, local spectator. Just starting out in his own MMA no. career. That's crazy. Posed with a UFC <laughs> Conor McGregor's meteoric rise in fighting is like nothing we've seen before. His voice. A blue collar kid from the suburbs of Dublin who ended up putting the country of Ireland on his back for an unthinkable voyage. Uh, a journey that took him from the local scene in front of hundreds to the most and he submitted somebody. In combat sports <laughs> history, which will play out in front of millions across the globe. Oh my god. I'm gonna knock him out inside four rounds, mark my words. What if he does, though? That he really wasn't here to take part, that he really was here to take over. I'd like to take this chance to absolutely nobody. Was it back in Cage Warriors? When he won back-to-back -back titles in the span of six months, and his name began to travel across the Atlantic, or was it when he busted the seams of hype? I love that the strut. Debut, and he returned home to Dublin a superstar. Or when Bean That's Jones the best. Supported his sprint towards Aldo. That's the best. <laughs> That's the best. <laughs> for the one they call notorious. Somewhere along the way, he became Mystic Mac. He sought out bigger challenges and debunked reports of his own vulnerabilities. He calls his own shots and gave the sport one of its great all-time rivalries. I don't give a f I don't give a f either. Doing the action from greater heights. It was as if he could see himself making history, mm. only to God. then redefine what history is. Oh my God. To have the audacity <laughs> to say that eight walls can't define him. Not with a once-in-a-lifetime chance to put boxing's greatest on the ropes. McGregor's historic run would feel unbelievable if it weren't documented and true. It's the stuff of legend. Nobody in UFC history has rose to every occasion with greater honor. Oh. From the earliest moments, it's been as if wherever the notorious Conor McGregor is going, he's already been there a thousand times before. That's so before, amazing. <laughs> His next stop shouldn't seem any different. I like the song. <laughs> Ooh. Yep, I'm hyped. Yup. Yup. Oh man. I just, I, I cannot. Because I've been talking, we've both been talking to people from like, feels like It's years. all anybody's been talking about. Yeah. And since like, they got like, announced, and even before this was so. like the first fight that I've seen on the local news. This is the first. Like, I wake fight up that's... in the morning, I sit with my cup of joe, turn on the telly. The telly. The, no, the telly. Then on, on the news, they're talking about this fight. It's like that's the first time a fight this big has ever made it to the news. This like is this. one of the first fights to transcend fighting. It's now pop culture at this point. Yeah. It's it's mainstream because you know. 
were huge UFC fans, UFC 205 in New York was the biggest card in the history of the UFC. Three title fights. McGregor won his second belt. But it's not like like if you walked up to somebody and said, hey, are you excited about the fights this weekend? Like just random on the road. Most likely they'd be like, huh? Like yeah. what fight? This one's like, so the fight this weekend, oh, dude. <laughs> it's like, or Or it's like, Oh, yeah, I heard about that. At least something to that extent. You know. Here's the thing about this fight. and you Sweat, know, this, we, Sweat we've, this, We've talked so much about it, so I'm not really – I don't want to really get into who we think is going to win or anything. It's, it's, <laughs> it's, <laughs> the, it's the people that I see that are saying, you know, I'm not going to watch this fight. This fight's a joke and, you know, just you know all that stuff. Like – who stuck thorns up these people's asses? I don't know. <laughs> like, this is. No idea. Here's the thing. It, it, this didn't even have to be Mayweather. Or, sorry, McGregor. You put anybody in there against Mayweather, and I'm going to root for the other guy. So, like, people are like, I can't believe you, you think McGregor's going to win, or you're rooting for him. It's like, dude, you could have put in Schlub Sub McGillicuddy across from Mayweather, and I would have rooted for him. I just don't care for the, the man. But. It, it's those people, I guarantee you, who are like, this fight's a joke, I'm not watching it, who are going to be those last-minute buyers of the pay-per-view. Do you feel better? Who are going to be the... <laughs> who are going to be the... They're going to succumb to that peer pressure because they're going to know at that last minute. I'm, I'm like... Everybody on Earth's watching this right now. I can't not watch it. You know what I'm saying? Like, if I'm... Could you imagine if the power went out right before the fight? You know, knock on wood, we can't, we can't risk that shit. <laughs> Do you feel better? Feel better about what? It was like, it was like a two-minute rant. Sorry, I don't think it was two minutes. Ah, ah I don't know. Ah. So let us know what you guys thought down in the comment section below. Make sure you guys like, comment, share, subscribe, so that you don't miss anything from this channel. Make sure you go check out our Patreon as well. Help support the channel. Get some cool rewards. Make sure you stay tuned. Stay iconic and cue music. Holy grail.